Hey, it's John with Smart Racing Products. We've got this International Scout in here today. We're gonna to do some suspension work. Part of that's gonna be setting camber. So we're gonna walk you through a few different scenarios you might run into. Come on in. So typically when we're measuring camber, you're gonna fall into one of two scenarios. You're gonna be on even ground or uneven ground. Uh, even ground example would be scale pads. You've already leveled your scales. You're doing a whole setup and that's your new known zero. Uneven ground is everything else. Uh, shop floor like this that might be on a little bit of a pitch or you're at the racetrack in the paddock and you're on some lumpy asphalt. We're gonna walk through both of those situations and show you how to do it. So if you're measuring camber on an uneven surface, which for us, this is our shop floor, it's pretty level, but not dead level. So we'll call it uneven. It could be uh, the racetrack paddock on some lumpy asphalt or in a gravel driveway. You just need to create a new horizontal plane that gets you up off anything that's uneven. For us, we try to use stuff that we can get, you know, easily from a store. These are some square floor tiles, but you could shear some aluminum squares, pieces of plywood. It just needs to be a little patch that normalizes the lumpy ground underneath. You've got a socket here as a spacer. There's one on each side. They just want to be the same height. And then this long aluminum bar. I have aluminum stock, but you could use uh, a long bubble level or a steel stud from the hardware store. This is just going to create a new horizontal plane that you'll do your, your Alt Zero off from. So on the Gen 3 module, you're going to press Hold and Alt. You'll see that it reads Alt. It's going to continue to flash Alt as you take your measurements, just to remind you that you're in an Alt Zero status. You'll come over here, put the gauge on the wheel, now you're reading your camber off that new alternate plane. You'll do this on the other front wheel because you already have your bar set up here. You'll press Alt Zero, you'll take your measurement there, and then you'll repeat the whole process uh, at the back axle doing uh, both wheels back there. By doing this, you're gonna be able to accurately set your camber on any surface, no matter where you're at. So an example of a level plane would be working off your scale pads. Uh, we've already set the scale pads up, we've leveled them underneath with shims, um, and that, that's an important part of setting up scales is making sure they're perfectly level to each other. So by doing this, now we are effectively sitting on a perfectly level plane. This, this truck doesn't know the ground anymore, it only knows what its tires are touching. So because we're in this perfectly level plane on setup pad, we don't have to do any type of alt zero. You can just go directly to the car and measure camber on all four corners. No need to do any alt zeroing as you go around the vehicle. So if you're lucky enough to have pads, you've got an even surface and you go straight to it.